Hey everyone, it's Divine Readings with a Gypsy, and today's prompt is five decks on top of your wish list. Number one, the Dandeloff Tarot. Tarot. The Dandeloff is the number one deck that I would want this year in 2017. 2017, I wish that I had the Dandeloff. I heard that it's again available, but you have to ask the deck creator for the Dandelof Tarot and all that stuff, so I don't know, and I don't know how much he's wanting it. Number two deck, Orbifold. The infamous Orbifold Tarot has still not yet come into my collection. I wanted it last year, but I couldn't get it. Number three Tarot is the Tarot of Invisible Light. That's the only photography deck I would ever purchase. Is the Tarot of Invisible Light. But, it comes at a pretty price. I think the last time I tried to look and see how much she's selling the Tarot of Invisible Light, it was like $60 plus shipping. I would have to trade an arm and a leg to get that one if I was to get that one in a trade as well. Number four, Tarot, is the Guiding Echoes Oracle. That one that's been going around, the Guiding Echoes, that one, Etsy one, Guiding Echoes. Number five would be the Hardy Tarot. That's one I've been envying for a little bit. I'm probably going to cheat and I'm going to just rattle off my deck list and tell you which decks I like. Mm, which other ones if I like. That one tarot. That's not very specific, but um, I would love to have a better Marseille deck. That's another one on my deck wish list. Oh, the Tramfa de la Lune. Uh, or the one with uh, Patrick Villuenza. That one, the new one. I wanted that one. Too expensive. I'm on a deck ban. I can't buy any tarot decks until my husband gets a better job. I would love to get the full size of the Bohemian Gothic. I hope it's still available when things uh, get worked out. Another one on my wish list would be the Colored Mythical Creatures Tarot. I was saying that in my deck review of the Mythical Creatures. I would love to get the colored edition and out after I had the Microm edition. Let me think on um, what other decks have I been envying on my wish list since I'm on this topic and the number five is out of the category is I would like to get a third edition of the Wild Unknown just because I like to have the uh, something different from the first edition. I have my first edition, but I would like to change it up and have the third edition, and because I didn't need the second edition. Uh, 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 uh. I think that sums it up. I think that's most of them that I've been wanting for a while. And then there's other decks that I've been envying and stuff, and I'm like, that's pretty over there. But I don't need to put it in my deck, deck collection because I can enjoy it from afar. And those are my top decks for my wish list because they're not top five anymore. And you will all have a wonderful day, and I can't wait to see other people's decks wish list.